This is James Held of I Film London. We're in the Only Fools and Horses Convention 2011. With me, I have British actor Nabil Nawabi. That's the one. Should I say Gary? Gary for today. That's I sure. Absolutely iconic character. Absolutely iconic character, sir. Um, absolutely privileged to be part of British history. Yep, yep. Brilliant fun. Well, absolute national institution. What What was it like? I know you was only featured in the one episode playing Gary, but working with actors and this and this kind of thing. It was amazing. I mean, it was like you know something I'd grown up on, and then suddenly to be involved in in it and not in it just in it in a really cracking episode if I may say so myself actually one of my favorite episodes sir. it's a top one my barometer and my brothers both of them are serious fools and horses fans and they just thought when they said yeah that was the one I knew it was the one because because they don't mince their words what was it like when John Sullivan said Nabil I've got something for you I, I want you to play Gary better still this is, uh, this is how it went. I nearly didn't get the job because it, one of the dates clashed with a film that I was doing at the time. No way. So I got a call from my agent saying, yeah, you got the job. Then I got a call from my agent saying, really sorry, you ain't. It clashes. Then I got a call saying, they liked you so much, they've cancelled, they've dropped the scenes that you couldn't do, and you've got the job again. So Fantastic. It was, yeah, it was top. It was top. How much did... Being in Only Fools and Horses, a young actor, help you and give you a, a little lift in the bill. What was it like? I mean, that was nearly 10 years ago. And look, I mean, we're here. There's about, what, 4,000 people down here? It's about three days since then. Oh, bless you. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, it's amazing. It's, you know, it's a landmark job. Yeah, it's a right, landmark it's, job. Actually, it's, you've, you've got your work cut out again today. I can see more people leaving, more people coming in by the second. It's going to have to do a lot of work. That sounded dodgy. Sorry. <laughs> well, and don't shake my hand with that one. We, we'll use the other one for now. <laughs> nice talking you two chaps, man. All right. Real fantastic. Thank you again for your time, and um, we'll, we'll be watching and watching what you're doing in the future with great interest, sir. Bless you, bless you, bless you. Oh, I'll tell you what, I'll give a little plug. I am going to be in a play November the 22nd till December the 3rd at the Tristan Bates Theatre Actors Centre. I will be playing the part of the Lebanese poet and painter Khalil Gibran. Classic. Come and see me. How much of that is a twist from Gary to plan? Can you repeat, you repeat your character name for me? So I wouldn't even try to pronounce that. A 1900s Lebanese painter and poet, Khalil Gibran, author of, a, one of a, a book which has sold over 100 million copies, wow. The Prophet. Amazing. Well, I wish you the best of luck with that, sir. Thank you, thank you very much. James Holder for iPhone London. Thank you. And next actor to make it to the stage in right now, uh, you may well recognise, not only from Fools and Horses, the last episodes were filmed in 2001 and went out a little bit later. We have Gary with us. Nabil, give a round of applause, Gary. Um, I was just chatting to him early on and I was trying to just work out, I asked him a few questions and I said, um, what's the name of that person that presents Match of the Day? And do you know what he said? Gary! And then I thought, in, the, in Good Night Sweetheart, uh, Nick Linders played a character, and I couldn't remember his name, and I said, um, I said what, what, was, what was his name in, in Good Night Sweetheart? And do you know what he said? Gary! Gary! <laughs> do you want to say something else? <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh wow, it's really overwhelming to be here. Um, like some of the previous speakers have said, it's, uh, it's, it's an honour to be here really. And um, you know, God rest his soul, I, I nearly didn't do the job because one of the days clashed. And, uh, and you know, he wanted me to do it so much they shifted some of the filming for me. And uh, this has become one of the jobs um, that's marked my career so far. And thank you all so much for coming down and showing your support. It means a lot. Thank you very much. Nabil, ladies and gentlemen. Gotti, Gotti, Gotti. Gotti, Gotti, Gotti.